In this video series, I'm going to show you how to repair your stats. Firstly, I'm going to explain how stats work, and then I'm going to present you the technique on how to hyper-rank your stats to make repairing them fast and easy. Sometimes you'll get distracted by real life, You'll disconnect, you'll have to multitask, and you'll see all your long hard work just disappear just like that. So what you'll normally do is just spend a long time building them back up, getting a lot of the duty reports. However, unfortunately, stats are not actually based on duty reports. For example, when was the last time you saw your rank change when you just got an incredible? When was the last time you hit that lead point or that break and you saw your rank jump up? The times you will see your rank change are on events such as abandoning your station or entering a new environment. For example, transitioning into a sword fight on a pillage, or entering or exiting a sea monster hunt. So what does a rank actually look like? Now these numbers are presented in a queue, like this. So here I've got a number of 3000 scores and a 2500 score here. Now, each time I abandon my station or I change my environment, a new score gets pushed on the front and the old one gets shoved off the back. So here, I'm going to budge this 2000 along. I'm going to put a 1000 on the end. So here, I've just done a relatively bad session and the number of a thousand has just gone in. Now what this means is you have to spend some considerable time pushing off the bad scores that you've just done. So it isn't a case of you have a rank and if you do well it goes up, if it goes bad it goes down. It is unfortunately not as simple as that. If you have a higher rank, there are going to be more of these entries. So that means it can take longer to push these bad scores off and get your rank back up. However, on the flip side, it also means that your rank won't be as susceptible to these bad scores in the first place. Because this 1000 for a sublime if you had, say, a hundred scores comprising your rank, you know, it would just be a teeny tiny little flip. So Sublime will have a far more accurate representation of their abilities. Now, what we're going to do in the coming videos is show you how to, say, take a score like this 3000 and split it up so that it actually gets counted several times. Instead of spending two hours on a sea monster hunt to get just one score, what I'm going to do is spend 30 seconds to get one of these scores. And as a result, I can get my rank up a lot faster. Bear in mind, this does not give you anything you wouldn't otherwise have. So it's not some magic formula to get your rank up. This is simply a way to get rid of grinding and split up your scores. 